Welcome to new video, we upload informational videos daily. Make sure to subscribe us. Follow us on Instagram and Twitter, link is in description, let's jump to video. Al Biruni was born in September 5, 973 in Khwarezm. His first 25 years were spent in Khwarezm where he studied fiqah, theology, grammar, mathematics, astronomy, medics and other sciences. The end of the 10th century was the age of the social unrest in Islamic world. Thus in 995, he left for Bukhara and in 998, he went to the court of the Ziyarit Amir of Tabaristan, where he wrote his first important work, al athar al Bakia and al Quran al Kaliya on historical and scientific chronology. In 1017, al-Biruni was taken to Ghazna, by Mahmud Ghaznavi. Biruni was made court astrologer. After Indian invasion, he was sent to India, for a few years, where Biruni became familiar with all things related to India, even Sanskrit. During this time he wrote the Kitab Tariq al hind around 1030. Al-Biruni was one of the greatest scholars of the medieval Islamic era and who contributed to physics, mathematics and astronomy, geography, pharmacology, mineralogy, history, chronology, religion and ideology. He was aware of different languages Persian, Arabic, Sanskrit, Greek, Hebrew, Syriac and Berber. He recorded observations of his travels of India in his book Kitab al-Hind which gives an account of the historical and social conditions of the subcontinent. He translated two Sanskrit books into Arabic. He regarded the Indus Valley as an ancient sea basin. On his return from India, Al-Biruni wrote his famous book Kanan i Masudi, in which he discussed several theorems of astronomy, trigonometry, solar, lunar, and planetary motions and relative topics. His other book al athar al baqia was account of ancient history of nations, with geography. In this book he also discussed the rotation of the earth and has given correct values of latitudes and longitudes of various places. He also wrote the Kitab al Saydana about medics. His book the Kitab al Jamahir deals with the properties of various precious stones. Al-Biruni discussed, centuries before the rest of the world, that the earth rotates around its axis or. His book al tafhim li a whale sinaa al tanjim gives a summary of mathematics and astronomy. He was the first to undertake experiments related to astronomical phenomena, which laid down the early foundation of modern science and astronomy. He explained the working of normal springs and artesian wells by the hydrostatic principle of communicating vessels. He observed that flowers have three, four, five, six, or eighteen petals, but never seven or nine. His important work was the method of determining the radius and circumference of the Earth. Al-Biruni wrote about 200 books and made a few instruments for astronomy. The illustrating method proposed and used by Al-Biruni to estimate the radius and circumference of the Earth laid the foundation of modern astronomy and became the base of astronomy. Al-Biruni was a pioneer in the study of comparative religion. He studied Zoroastrianism, Judaism, Hinduism, Christianity, Buddhism, Islam, and other religions. In Tariq al hind he explored every aspect of Indian life, including religion, history, geography, geology, science, and mathematics. He has been considered as one of the very greatest scientists of Islam. His critical spirit, love of truth, and scientific approach were combined with a sense of toleration. He died in 1048 AD at the age of 75, after having spent 40 years in thus gathering knowledge and making his own original contributions to it. Make sure to subscribe us. Follow us on Instagram and Twitter, link is in description.